Once upon a time in a faraway land, a beautiful girl was born to the king and queen. Servant! Yes, Your Majesty. Are all preparations done? Of course, Your Majesty, already. Look, she's smiling at me. She must be a little too. Oh, my sweet little princess. Your Majesty, our guests are here. Let them in. Welcome to the royal court. Fairies from all over were invited for the celebration. They brought with them precious gifts and blessed the little princess. May she become a clever, beautiful and kind. Your Majesty, we are glad to come and celebrate with you today the birth of your dear daughter, the newborn royal princess. Welcome, dear fairies. We are honored to have you in this happy day. Please enjoy the feast. Wow, this is superb. How can I help you? I would like a piece of the turkey and. Um... Unfortunately, the happy gathering turned into a horror scene. They didn't invite me to the celebration. I will show them what they deserve for that. Suddenly, an old wicked fairy came to the palace and cursed the princess. Hey, hey, hey! Abracadabra! Please stop! No one can stop me on her 60th birthday. She will break up mentally and die. The wicked fairy said in anger and vanished. Everybody was shocked. Oh no! What does that mean? She cursed my innocent baby. Oh no! A young fairy rose and said. I can't take away the evil witch curse, but I'll try to help. When the prince wakes herself, she won't die, but she fall into a deep sleep and will only awaken with a kiss of prince who loves him. The king and queen were so worried for their dear daughter. Oh, your majesty, that can't be real. Please do something. You must stop that scary witch. Servant! Please dismiss our guests. As you wish, Your Majesty. Good evening. I wish you a good evening. strong. Things will get better. It might be strong now, but it can't rain forever. Let's go. God! God! Yes, Your Majesty. It's an emergency order. Whatever I do, Your Majesty, I'll do my best. Destroy all the spinning wheels of the kingdom now. Right away, Your Majesty. However, unknown to them, one spinning wheel was still left. As the years went by, the baby grew to be a lovely, charming young girl. On her 16th birthday, when she was roaming about the castle, she came upon a secret road at the very top of the castle towers. Curious, she went to find an old woman bent over a spinning wheel. Wow, what is this? She cried, for she had never seen such a thing before. This is a spinning wheel. Please, do this means right as well. No, no, it's not for young girl. She pleaded. Please, please. Okay, but only for a little bit. But the minute she touched the needle of the spindle, she fell to the ground. <laughs> I got you, little ugly thing. Now, sleep forever. <laughs> the witch's spell had come true. Princess, princess, where are you? Are you playing hide and seek? We're worried about you. Oh no! King, king! I can't believe we lost our daughter. For the heavy heart, the king ordered. God! Yes, Your Majesty. Take her to a grand room where she will lay for many years. All right, Your Majesty. The whole kingdom was sad.
the youngest fairy watched all of this. She said with a wave of her wand. The whole kingdom fell asleep with the princess. So when she is looking by her prince, she will not be alone. The moment she said this, all the people and the animals in the kingdom fell asleep where they were. Everything stopped. As the years went by, a thick forest grew around the palace and the kingdom to hide it. Exactly a hundred years later, a handsome prince was passing through the forest when he discovered a strange kingdom. What a strange kingdom! Mm, interesting. I want to see what is in there. While exploring it, he was surprised to, to find the beautiful princess laying fast asleep. I wonder who she is. He immediately fell in love with her. How gentle and peaceful she looks. He leaned down and kissed her. Instantly, a spell was lifted. The prince and all the people awoke. Who are you, I am the one who saved you and your kingdom. Came here while everybody was sleeping. Your kingdom was cursed, and now you are all free. That's unbelievable. Father, mother, did you hear that? Yes, my dear. This man deserves, deserves a real salute. Your Majesty, I am the Prince of Ireland. Princess, will you marry me? Of course I will. There was joy and celebration all around, and the prince and princess were soon married and they lived happily ever after. The end.